Hi again, YouTubers. So this is my March five favorites and one regret. And I didn't really buy a whole lot. I only had one haul uh, in the whole month of March. So I'm still trying to get through those 50 reviews. Gosh, never thought it would take that long to take 50 reviews, but it does. Um, plus I've been busy with other stuff. So um, anyway, let's see here. Five favorites are only one I think is something that I bought this month. The rest are things I've had so that are kind of coming back up and are still favorites. So the first thing I'm going to start with is my Shiseido Sun Protection Liquid Foundation, very water resistant with the SPF 42. I've been wearing this because it's been nice out again. The sun's back out. Um, right now I'm in SP 60. I also have 50 and I mix a little bit of 50 in and I have it on right now. And I am loving this stuff again. For some reason, it just is amazing. It looks like skin on me. The color match is perfect. I really love the NARS Sheer Glow, but it gets a little bit yellow on me So um, after a while. So this one is still, no matter what, my favorite. Another favorite is my Origins uh, Multigrain Makeup in the color Medium. It is multigrain makeup with an SPF of 14, fortified with oats, vitamins, and minerals. And I love this stuff. I have this on right now as well absolutely love it. I think this is like my third or fourth thing of this since I started with it last September. So I love this. Cannot do without that. Um, another favorite, this is one thing I did purchase and this is the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Matte Bronzing Powder. This is what the container looks like and this is what the bronzer looks like and I have it on right now um, just as a contour but I love that this is so matte and I like it better than Hula because it doesn't have that muddy look to it, but I love it. Um, next favorite, I think I did buy this one. I had one, but this is another one um, because mine was getting very small. Um, and I now put that, the smaller one is going to um, our summer house so that I have one up there. Um, but this is Teddy's Eye Coal and it's by MAC and it's just a really dark true brown. And I've been wearing a lot more brown on my waterline versus black um, as it's getting nicer and warmer out because I feel like it's just a little bit lighter looking and it doesn't make me feel as heavy in the eyes. So um, I went back to using Teddy and I absolutely love it. It's just a great liner. Um, and then the next thing I've been loving is an eyeshadow. It's one of the first couple eyeshadows I ever got from MAC. I think this is one right here and it's called Scene. And let me swatch it for you. It's just like a matted gray which actually I'm putting it on my there we go it's just a nice gray um, I have been actually loving this as funny as it is I have been putting it on um, as opposed to two again I've been doing a little bit lighter of an eye I haven't been wearing as dark of colors but I've been putting scene I have it on right now just over in the outer V and then I take soft brown blend it in and I'm done like that's it. And I put a little bit of highlight on the top, but I've been loving it for that. And it just looks great. And it just gives really nice definition. And it still has, um, the brown kind of blends it in and makes it look like it's just got that definition to your crease. So I'm loving that. And my one regret, and I'm going to post the review after this, I'll post the review in the next day or so on this product. And it is Re 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 <laughs> Revlon Photo Ready. I was really tossed up on this and I have I bought it first in the color three and now I have it in four which is nude and I like the product I don't like the shimmer in it um, I'll use it up and I've been using it honestly just on days that are cloudy out when the sun's not out but I guess I look at it and go for foundation like I don't want to have one that I can only wear if it's a cloudy day doesn't make sense so it's kind of my regret um, I went back and forth with this guys the reason it took so long to do a review and it'll be up soon is just because I really tried everything I could think of with this I tried different lights um, I just tried everything I could think of to make it work and it works do not get me wrong it does work but I don't want this shimmer to my face if I go out in the Sun that's noticeable to me so that's just my two cents. So that's pretty quick. Uh, five favorites and one regret for March. And uh, we'll see what YouTube does. Uh, somebody said it on Twitter today that uh, we'll see what YouTube does for April 1st because last year they turned the videos upside down. So it'll be interesting to see. So thanks so much for watching, guys. Let me know if you have any questions. And I'll talk to you all soon. Thanks so much, guys. Bye.